All right, so in this one, if we want to evaluate the integral using area, again, we have a line. And we know that its uh, line has a y-intercept at negative 2. Yes? And we want to evaluate it from 0 to 3. Now, if we want to figure out where this graph is at 3, we could e easily just plug in 3, right? Would you guys agree? And we see that at 3, we're at the point 3, comma 1. And if we want to figure out where this graph crosses the uh, the x-axis, we could just set x minus 2 equal to 0 and say x equals 2. So there's the x-intercept there. And we can see that's basically what we're looking at. Now, if we're going to integrate this, do we already kind of know what our integrand is going to be? If it's be besides even looking at the integral, just by kind of visualizing this area or this net area, we know that our net area kind of looks like it's going to be ne ne negative, right? Do you guys agree? So rather than doing the algebra here, or doing the algebra, let's geometrically figure this out. So we have this area. And that area is going to be, uh, remember, area of a triangle, 1 half base times height. Okay, And that's part of the reason why. So why we're going over this rectangle, I didn't write that down. But hopefully you guys remember base times height for a uh, parallelogram. And um, or sorry, for a not for a parallelogram, but for a, uh, a rectangle square. And then if we're here, um, what am I trying to do? Yeah, so we have 1 half. So the area of this figure is going to be 1 half base, which would be times 2, times 2. However, visually we understand this also to be negative. So that's going to be negative. So therefore, we have 2 times 2 is 4 times 1 half is going to be 2. So that's going to be a negative 2 plus. And then over here, let's figure out what this is. So if that's 2, 2 to 1 is 1. So that's 1. So And that's positive. So it would be 1 half times 1 times 1, which equals a positive 1 half. So therefore, that gives me a negative um, 1 and a half, which would be a negative 3 halves. Yes? No? Questions? We're OK. All right. 